Hello, you two. Welcome to my new workbench. That was the old one. That's my dad's. This is mine now. So I have my workbench, which is pretty cool. As you can see, I'm up to my ass in projects. <laughs> and I've got the pink radio blaring down here. The reason I'm using this thing is because it gets better reception than this crappy black RCA one. So, there you go. So, I figured out what was wrong with this MacBook Pro. I tried to reinstall OS X on here, and it had errors during installation. Now, this thing had a 500 gigabyte Toshiba SATA hard drive in it. This thing is a SATA hard drive. It said ATA on the screen in LSPCI, so... I guess it uses an IDE controller for SATA. Because, yeah. So I tried it with the Intel SSD. And it installs and works perfectly fine with the SSD. So, my conclusion is that this Toshiba drive is bad. Toshiba is not exactly the most amazing manufacturer of hard drives ever, so that drive will go in the crusher. <laughs> and I'm going to buy probably a Western Digital Caviar or Scorpio Black and stick it right in there. This is what the inside of the MacBook Pro looks like. It's got, an, it's got a uh, Hitachi LG DVD drive in it, and that's where the hard drive goes. So, I'll get that taken care of soon. And that's just an update on the, uh, the MacBook Pro. Once that's put together, I'll add it on to this video. Alright, we have a shiny new Western Digital Scorpio Black, 500 gigabyte in this computer now, so that should replace the old um, Toshiba drive that failed prematurely somehow. So, stick this drive back in and see how it goes. Alright, there's no light over here. That's better. OS X is installing quite smoothly. It's gotten past the part before where it had the error. And this drive seems to be humming along just fine. So, hopefully this thing will survive the update process and everything. I'll show you uh, once it's done. However, I have to take this over to the customer's house to get so they can put their information in there. So all I can really show you is the intro. <laughs> Here it goes. Yep, it worked. So, there's your confirmation. Where's the... That's better. And there you have it. This Mac seems to be up and running again. And the culprit was this damn Toshiba hard drive. So that's probably going to get tossed. That's probably going to get smashed up. Mac OS X includes a built-in screen reader called VoiceOver. If you know how to use VoiceOver... Mute. <laughs> Anyhow, that's the conclusion to this Mac. For now, anyway. It seems to be working since I replaced the hard drive. That being the problem, so... There you have it. And, uh, that's it. Have a good one, everybody. Ciao.